Hey everybody, Chrome Bandit y'all, and uh, I have to address this ghost problem just because everyone else is addressing it. It's gotten to the point of hand in which literally everybody is um, complaining about it. Oh yeah, first of all, this is some only knifing gameplay. Um, well, I get my kill streak only knifing, and then I use my kill streaks, and the rest is history. Um, these people were really bad. I was. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty decent with a blisking knife. And, uh, yeah, so I'll just hop straight on Ghost. Um, this is my solution for Ghost. All I hear about is people complaining about how Ghost is overpowered because there's nothing to combat Ghost anymore. Um, my response to that, first of all, is that Ghost is actually a counter itself. It's a counter to spy planes. And, honestly, I'd say it was a valid perk right now. I have no problem with it. And I don't even use it either. Um, but... You know, if you feel like Ghost is a little out of hand and just uh, too overpowered for you, this is my suggestion. Um, take out the spy plane. And, uh, <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa there, cowboys. Whoa, whoa. Um, <laughs> before I stir up all the hype for, for this, i just like to say that I came from Halo when I first started playing Call of Duty. When I learned that there was a three kill streak to get... Uh, something that, something that you can basically find out where everybody is in the map. Um, I was like, wow, that's uh, a little overpowered. But I rolled with it because, you know, no, no one on COD 4, which is my first Call of Duty game, no one really used UAV Jammer that much, or I didn't say anybody really used UAV Jammer. And, uh, yeah, so, I mean, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna come back to it, and I'm not gonna say that the spy plane, oh my god. I'm just gonna ignore that. Um, I'm not gonna say that the spy plane. Okay, you know what? Are are you done, phone? Are you done? Nope. Do 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 Please tell me you're done. Thank God. Okay. Anyways. Um. So basically, I'm saying that the spy plane is. I, I'm thinking. I'm not saying the spy plane is overpowered. It's more like solve ghost. It can be taken out. I mean, because if you look at if you look at it this way, what does ghost do without pro? It makes you avoid. It makes you avoid spy planes. Okay. Now, w what I'm saying is that basically. You just if you take out the spy plane, first of all, I get a little paranoid whenever I hear a spy plane up and I'll have ghost on because I don't like being seen all the time. Um because spy plane is such a low kill streak, especially since more people are using hardline to get two kill streak for the spy plane. I mean, freaking the spy plane's up all the freaking time, okay? I don't understand how you can actually put that in, in in the game, I mean, I get and, and have. I guess you have the counter to it, Ghost. But I don't want to be using Ghost every freaking time I play Call of Duty. Okay, I, I enjoy using other perks besides Ghost. And if you're gonna if you're gonna put Spy Plane in it, make it a bigger kill streak. Like I'd say a five kill streak for a Spy Plane. And if you're not you're not even opposed to that, I'd say just take it out altogether because then basically you're taking out people getting pissed off by Ghost because. Um, from an anonymous source, uh, one of my friends, whenever he complains about ghosts, he basically just says it promotes camping. And he doesn't be like being shot in the back, basically. And, um, I, gu I guess, I mean, that, that, that totally eliminates, I mean, ghost people t t tend to, like, be sneaky and uh, be really patient. And patience usually means sitting in one spot, and when sitting in one spot could be classified as camping. Um, speculation, speculation, speculation. And so basically, if you take out spy plane, um, you won't even need to worry about ghosts anymore. And my suggestion is once, I mean, you can keep the, the perk ghosts in the game. Once you take out the spy plane, um, actually, I I also suggest keeping counter spy plane in there because that's actually nothing nothing wrong with that at all. Besides, people don't even use counter spy plane to actually combat spy planes anyways. They just use it to jam the radar. Um, but yeah, I mean. If you just take out a spy plane, my suggestion for ghost is to um, 32 and 2. By the way, that's my, that's my score. 
um, is basically make you visible to infrared scopes, visible to, to uh, sentry guns. Um, actually, a cool idea. I don't know if that, this that could apply to anything, but um, making your air support invisible to SAM turrets, I mean, or or uh, unavailable for lock on. That'd be kind of interesting. See how that would work. And uh, also, I don't know. I, if you have any suggestions for a ghost without avoiding spy planes, I mean, maybe maybe uh, the counter spy plane wouldn't work for you if you have ghost on or ghost pro or whatever. Um. You're basically invisible to most things, or like your aircraft can't be locked onto. That if they actually shoot it down manually. Um, and I've shot down attack helicopters with RPGs before, so that's not much of a problem for me. Um, I'm trying to brainstorm any other I ideas I can have for a ghost, kind of a ghost without invisible to spy plane. But yeah, basically the main problem here is the spy plane. I mean, okay, look at this from the this way, all right? Three kill streak. Or if you have hardline on a two kill streak, okay, which is really easy in Call of Duty. I mean, I freaking I got like my highest kill streaks at w at one game was like 27. And I used I used three, four, five. Well, two, three, four because I had hardline on. All right, and that is just ridiculous. Okay, um, let's just say that one third of those were spy planes. I got nine spy planes that game. Okay, nine spy planes. Okay, if you're not wearing ghost, that means I can see where you are for, let's see, 9 times 3 is 27, 270 seconds. Which is about, I don't know, that's about, that's about a little bit more than 4 minutes, I'd say. Um, so for basically um, 4 minutes of the game, I knew exactly where you were if you didn't have ghost on. Okay, well, not exactly because that little update um, thing the radar has, but still... I mean, that's just, I don't know, it just seems overpowered to me. And I'm i am all for, I mean, like, I'm totally fine with the spy plane, usually, but it's this is just, just for the ghost complainers, alright? If you're if you're worried so much about ghosts, just appeal towards taking out the spy plane. And uh, that'll solve world hunger on Call of Duty. Um, I'll still keep using spy plane until they take it out, obviously. I mean, next time someone finds something overpowered, what's the first thing you want to do? You want to use it, right? By playing the most popular kill streak, it's the lo also the lowest kill streak. I mean, you gotta see, you gotta see the reasoning, okay? It's, 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 um, basically know where anybody is, which is, so it's, it's like a blackbird that updates every like three seconds. If you don't have ghosts on, and there's only one perk that prevent it, one perk, and a kill streak too, but no one wants to run counter spy plane. It's also the default kill streak. So it's the lowest kill streak. There's even a perk that can make it one kill lower than it usually has to be, which makes it even more appealing. Um yeah guys, you can totally just brainstorm more ideas for uh Ghost Pro. Like I think I uh, yeah. Fifty one and three I think the game ends here too. Um I'll just gonna leave you guys to it. Um I'll probably be getting a lot of mixed uh Mixed approval for this video. But I'm totally alright with that. Um, as long as you're cool about your opinion, I'll be cool about mine, and we can all be friends here. Or we'll just be like, fuck you, you fucking bitch. Pipeline's best skill streak ever, and you can go suck a dick. Uh, or it can be like, you know, I disagree with you. I think Spyplane is a very good kill streak. Hmm, yes, hmm, quiet. Uh, well, yeah, that's about it. I'll see you guys later. Let me know what you think.